What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Trick Tutorial Tuesdays, the series on my channel where every Tuesday I break down a trick and I tell you what's up with it. And today, we're looking at whip rewinds. So obviously whip rewind is the tail whip and you're gonna be kicking it back heel side after that. It'll be doing a heel whip. And what I would recommend for this trick is you having your tail whips just as good as your heel whips. Like no problem, tail whips fine, heel whips super good because with the whip rewind, you're gonna wanna have the tail whip good starting off, just as good as when it's coming down opposite. Because if you're just only good at tail whips, you'll have that part super good, but then the coming down part is going to be super hard and so that's going to have to be weird to adapt to. Having your heel ups just as good as your tail ups are literally going to help you so much for once you're actually done doing the tail up, kicking it back down on the heel and actually being able to land on it keeping it underneath you. So once you have both of those done, what you're probably going to want to do is find a bank so you can get a good amount of speed, good amount of air time so you can actually try this, potentially even resi fly out wherever you guys want to go. But definitely once you get enough speed and you have enough height to do the trick, obviously do a normal tail and once you're there, you kind of want to kick it back. And when you're actually doing these whip rewinds, I kind of like to think of it as if I'm finishing the one tail up and then completely starting the next one. Now you are of course going to be kicking it because it is a rewind, but I kind of, if I were to put percentages on what I'm doing here, I'm putting 20% effort into actually kicking the deck and then kind of 80% in finishing the whip and then just doing another one if that makes any sense. I'm basically saying it's less of something like, you know, like that when you're kicking it hard and kind of more of something like when you're finishing one to the other and it kind of looks a lot cleaner and I think it performs better too. And so the main thing when you're actually doing this is actually getting enough speed to get that tail up back so you're still in the air leveled out so that way you can actually fling the heel whip and have it leveled so you can land on top of it. And of course when you're doing these whip rewinds it's going to be a lot with your arm movements too once you finish that whip to kind of use your arms to jerk it the other way. And of course do some muscle movements of the whip rewind itself like sit here and just kind of get the whip rewind down, know how to get the first one out and then kick over the next one and then just kind of work on that and just getting that movement better. And the better you have the movement, it's gonna be easier once you're in the air to understand how to do that and to kick it back. And I know that landing heel was pretty awkward. It took me a long time to get used to that, but once you got all these kind of things down, you can throw it all together and hopefully get the whip rewind down. And so I'm gonna do one flat right now because I actually can't do this. One more. All right, here we go. I'm gonna finish that tail whip and kick it back. Stop. But essentially the main thing you want to do with whipping rounds is be using your arms to actually propel the deck in the tail whip direction you want to go. And then of course getting a good solid tail whip start off so that way you can have the speed to be able to kick it back. And again, keep practicing that movement. Get that completely solid so you completely understand how to whip rewind. And you guys should hopefully be good. So if you guys liked that video and it helped you on how to whip rewind, drop a like on it because it helps me and the channel out a bunch. Comment down below what you guys want me to do for the next trick tutorial Tuesdays. If you can break down the next trick, whatever you want, comment down below. And subscribe because we come out with videos on this channel every Tuesday, Thursday. Thursday and Saturday, so turn on post notifications so you don't want to miss the videos. And yeah, until the next Trick Tutorial Tuesdays, I'm out of here.